Hello, my name is Trey. Welcome to What Kind of Change. Let's go ahead and hop right into the video. I don't waste no time. So this guy gets pulled over for speeding, okay? And because he gets pulled over for speeding, you know, they're going to ask him some questions. They're going to say what's going on. Now, I want y'all to know that's how they talk to this cop. Shout out to Police Insider. Y'all know who it is. Go check them out. Link in the description if y'all want to watch the whole video or watch more great videos such as this one. So they pull him over for going, I think, 76 and a 25. Let's get it. I mean, 45. Literally going, get some food, bro, and come right back. But I can give you my name. Here go my, this is my, my, this is my girl name. Okay. I was just going to get some food. Red flag number one, they pulled him over. The cops pulled him over. Here they say, can we see your license? He goes and says, uh, this insurance is in my girl's name and my license is at home. He was done right there. Okay, how much weed's in the car? Realistically, how much weed's in the car? I can oh, smell really? it. I swear, look, I swear to God, I wasn't even smoking it. I wasn't even smoking it. This from last night. We just had it in here from last night. What up? You got anything else in the car? No. Nah. Guns, drugs, nah. weapons, hand grenades. Anything that a nah. canine would indicate on? Or he does have weapons in the car. I don't know why he didn't just admit to that. If you came out of the car, that would find if I got a little bit of that hypnotic. Nah. I'm just kidding. Pretty sure. I'm positive. The driver picked up a charge here for not informing the officer about the weapon he was carrying. Things were only going to get worse for him from here. Can you roll this back window down? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, man, she's about it, dude. She's got the plastic on the seat. Yeah, See man, how they're talking to him? I, sorry. <laughs> I just want to say this. I want you to notice how they're talking to him. I'm trying to be cool. Yeah, trying to be clean, cool. Man, cop talks to me like clean. this? Bro, please tell me that you're back, man. Huh? Please tell me that's your backpack. That's my daughter's. I'm going there. I tell them I have visited. Nah, that's my daughter's. It's good and none but clothes. Hey, sir. Ain't shit but clothes, man, bro. I ain't. I'm I don't know, bro. I'm starting to think nah. that's yours. Nah, man. It's my daughter's, bro. I'm about to take hey. About to get some food. I'm going to have visited. That would be next level if that was yours, though. Nah, but it has bro. to be real diamonds. 57,000 miles. Just because you could, I gave it to you for 30. And it, on market, it's going for 51 right now. This sells to me right now, 2019, 50, 53,000 miles, 30 grand. <laughs> hey, y'all for real. <laughs> Doesn't that sound like you're going down? Y'all seen that in the movies? Y'all seen that in the TV shows where they're all like, <laughs> in your head, you know you're thinking this man's going to jail. We got him. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. And here's the other funny part where I would have never done. They, tell, they ask him about the... Uh, one of his rims and tell him to get out the car and say like, hey man, come look at it. Uh, no, sir. I'm not getting out this vehicle. <laughs> you gonna have to it. rip me out this thing. I'm just kidding. Uh, stop. <laughs> I ain't got nothing on the back. This car's 21000 all day. <laughs> Cap. Stop. Cap. Uh, 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 right here. Look, Let's see the room. Can, that can be both. Rash, one rim. Uh, on the other side, he said. Well, Alright, my girl, you just swear <laughs> when you let your girl drive, bro. You can't be mean. Hey, twenty. It's a nice car, though. It's a nice car. Twenty-one thousand, no ticket. Uh, right. <laughs> <laughs> but I already knew he was gonna get on me because these. And they run a background track. They do all this stalling. Yeah, regardless, I still think they were gonna run a background track. He don't have his license. They're gonna do all this other stuff. But comes out to find out that this guy is lying, as explained to us by the people. So we're gonna move forward a little bit here. Um, and we're going to see that uh, he realizes he's done. I admit, though, he has a pretty good attitude about it. I'm pretty sure he's like, I'm not saying I don't know this man. I don't know nothing about this man. Unfortunately, they blocked out when this was happening. I'm assuming this happened either this year or a couple years ago. But I'll say this. Well, this is a 2019. So maybe this happened back then. But let me say this. I think this man knew he had money to bail out. That's why he's not throwing a big fit. You know how some people are just kind of upset. They're kind of like, man, you really arrested me. Because a couple of people are like, man, I'm about to go home, give me some McDonald's, eat me a cheeseburger. Now I got to eat biscuits and gravy in the morning. But some, you know, at the same time, I'm thinking he's thinking, I got money. I'll be out in the morning. And he even says, I can't even pick up the car till Monday, which he'll say later. Making me think he's got money. He's not really worried about it. Listen, I, once again, I'm not advocating for this lifestyle. I'm not advocating for selling drugs and all that. I'm not saying do all that. I am saying, though, this is how some people live. Paris Keaton. See, that's the thing you can't beat about Indiana, what I love about their license. It tells you all the information. I can tell you everything. You may be 225 pounds, but you definitely don't have that Social Security number. 
So he lied about his social security I'm number. Smarter than you think. And you wouldn't show me a Facebook. You had no internet connection. No, free, Out in the know. world, you have no internet connection. Oh, Come free, on. My man. shit not low. No, inf nothing but cash on you. What's your actual birthday? Oh shit. So everything's a lie. What's your middle name? I like how police oh inside her has that nice. music in the background. That do -do 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 do. Yeah, other channels don't tend to do that. Not even truthful at all, bro. Nah, you do it, bro. I don't be out here, bro. It's just, that's the taking my pocket. I paid that shit. I got the receipt in there, bro. I paid that shit twice. Twice. Yeah. They made. They said I didn't pay it. Then I came back up here and paid it again. Where's that ticket out of? Uh, Do Boys, I think. What's, what's wrong but with your you license? Yeah. If it's suspended, no, it's not suspended. Had, Never. It was so expired. If it's expired, then it should Over. be no big deal. Well, why don't you just go get a new one? Because they won't let me. So I had to get my Indiana one. Bro, it's a bunch. You're going to see. So do you got an Indiana license? Yeah. I got Indiana license. Where did it? I don't even... See, I'm not doing all these conversations, bro. I'm just going to be like, hey, man, just go ahead and take me to jail, bro. Just do what you got to do, man. How much? Like, I get too frustrated with that kind of stuff. I don't like small talk. If I already know I'm going to jail... I'm talking like I go to jail all the time. I'm talking like if it's in my head, like if this is me today, you know, not back in the day. But if this is me today and I, I know I haven't done a whole lot of things wrong. So if something came up and some reason I'm going to jail for some odd reason, I'd be like, what, what, how much is it going to cost me to get out? You know, uh, am I going to jail? OK, just go ahead and take me. I, I'm not being trying to be rude, but I'm not trying to have all the small talk. Just put me in a handcuff. So let's go. You know, I. I'm trying to be out by tomorrow morning. Let me call my wife and let me get up out of here. <laughs> you just said you was going like 64. See how they're still laughing and giggling with them? Then I slowed down. I'm not trying to do this laughing. I'm not doing this laughing and giggling, man. Just take me to jail. But they just seen the bright car, though. He was trying to excuse himself from the situation, but the officers had one more blow to deliver. No, it's not. Yeah. Yeah. Bro, y'all be right here. Yeah. Like, I ain't snitching on nobody, but y'all be right here. <laughs> nah, he probably gonna, it's gonna come out. I got any analysis, it's gonna come out here, say it's expired, but that shit was like from 2016, 17, bro. Like, so I just gave up. I just got my Indiana license. He say I was speeding, but I'm gonna get it to him. You know, be safe. nice to him when they let you go. He say. I ain't got shit. I'm good, man. I ain't tripping out that shit, bro. Okay, yeah. good news See, that here. phone call to bad. me? If I'm making that kind of phone call, I'm just saying, if I'm saying, hey, man, they got me for speeding, that should be code right there to be like, go ahead and get the money ready. Come bail me out. Because I'm not going to lie to my friends. I'm going to tell my friends, hey, man, if I ever call you and I say that I got pulled over, that means you need to be either on your way or you need to start stacking up money. Come get me out. They taking me to jail. You know, it's already a wrap. I'm not calling you to say they got me for speeding. I'm calling you to say. They picking me up, make sure everything's clean, make sure everything's... I'm talking like I'm a thug, but I'm not, baby. I'm a square. I'm, I'm SpongeBob, baby. I'm SpongeBob, okay? Uh, I'm a nobody. I'm just saying if it's me, though, I'm taking a call. Hey, man, how you doing? <coughs> they got me for speeding. Now, if I'm on the other line, oh, I mean, uh-oh, you know, this may be coming. He's about to get a couple charges. He may be in for a while. I need to go ahead and get bail ready. Go ahead and get a lawyer. Let's have all that ready to go. We got a couple hours to get this ready and move it. We got stuff to do. And if they're, if they're taking the car, there's a good chance if it is stolen, which I don't know. We got to get that thing up out of there as fast as possible. But, you know, we start putting this stuff together. That's the only reason I ever call a homeboy. I'm calling a homeboy not to tell him I'm going to jail. I mean, tell him I'm going to jail for fun. No, I'm calling him to be like, hey, baby, you know what to do. Okay, this is, you know how it goes. What's the bad news? Yeah. I got to take a car. Why? You don't have insurance. Oh God, we got insurance. Show me, show me so he, he goes on to say that he don't have insurance. He called his wife and or his girlfriend. His girlfriend says that, hey, we do have insurance, but it's on a 2014 Impala. Still, it's, the same it's, it's under the same. So we can't, we right, can't, we, look we can't get an insurance way. company's stuff. It has so, to say this vehicle. This says 2014 Chevy Impala. It's under. So I got to call insurance And this just company? says application. Yeah, for real. I got you. I, got you. I, got, I swear to God, I got insurance. You mind if I... Hey, damn. See, hey, I had shoulder surgery. Is it like four weeks ago? There you go. Is that like better? Like that? Yeah, is that better? We're not going anywhere just yet. I'm trying to just check. Crack the window, man. It's hot as hell. Yep. As soon as the officers got the man inside the police car, they searched his vehicle and found his guns. Hey, my gun ain't hot. My gun registered, man. We good. I thought Biden, I thought Biden passed, I mean, not Biden, Trump passed the oh. law for, 
You can you can take it over state so line. That's not the been when Trump was in office. I don't know. He said Biden. So long as you're not a felon. I, I don't ever see them blur this part out. So I have no idea when this time frame was. So what I got to do to get my gun back? I'm assuming about, it was you're you're this about year for them to say that. Which. No, I, I swear to God, I swear to God, bro, I didn't know I, know, I had a warrant, bro. To conceal something else, so, okay, that's already obstructing, there's a lot of charges. No, I thought, I thought, I thought my life was inspired out here, bro, I ain't, okay. hey Siri, call Lydia. Babe. It's all over, boys, and that's the end of this story, another man goes down. But I'm assuming this man knew he had warrants. Well, listen, man, I can tell you from a man who's had warrants back, back in my young days when I was out there thugging, you know, it's the thuggish ruggish. Just kidding. I just got city tickets. Nonetheless, um, <laughs> you, you know you got a warrant. It's not. It's not. It's always obvious you got a warrant because they send you. They call you. They send you letters. They tell you. They send you emails. Ain't no way on earth you gonna know you don't have a warrant. So he knows. I'm looking at the wrong camera. He knows. He's done. And uh, that's how it goes, man. You let me know what you would do if the cops start laughing and giggling. I'm assuming it's over for me. I might as well just go ahead and start doing my stretches to get my shoulder ready because they about to put me in these handcuffs. I don't do the laughing stuff. I don't do the giggling stuff. I like to get where I'm going. If you're going to take me to jail, just go ahead and take me. We don't have to talk about my car. We don't have to talk about any of that. I make that one phone call like he did. Hey, man, they got me for speeding. That should be code to let you know what's going on. Uh, once again, I'm not advocating for drugs, baby. I would tell my buddy, hey, I'm going to speeding ticket, you know, and then once once I get back out, but I mean, we got to go to church. Maybe we should quit this life. You know, maybe maybe, maybe we could turn our life around. Let's go uh, start a GTA uh, YouTube channel like Grizzy. You know, let's get in there and start making 20 bands. <laughs> anyway, and then, then you can live the thug life on GTA. If you really want to live the thug life, go do it on GTA. And then do it within the rules, though, you know, because there's still police and government. Anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think about this guy. Would y'all laugh and giggle with the police? I wouldn't. I say just take me to jail. Goodbye.